Get out of the way, I gotta save the day. Recycle. Bad news, bad news, it's all bad. Hey, welcome folks, it's time for another edition of Vocal Trash's Street Show. And today we're talking about trees and how we can try and quit cutting them down. Because you know that on average, if you were to recycle one-tenth of that paper, we would save 25 million trees a year. Stop cutting down trees. Or just recycle them, right? If you had to recycle them the right way, instead of just throwing it into the landfill, we'd save one billion trees from being cut down. Now, we're going to demonstrate some ways that you can make stuff purely out of paper. This necklace was donated by thegreenergood.com. Wow, the moving sign. <laughs> That's a bad sign. <laughs> this is such a cool necklace, actually. It's all fair trade, and this is purely out of paper. Isn't that really cool? That's very beautiful, and, and in fact, it looks like old puka shells, but more colorful. Now, there's also ways that you can actually make paper and not even use a tree. Larry, what do you got? Got some coffee grinds here. And this was made into paper? Yes. Isn't that amazing? Actually nice. What else you got? Also got some lime peels. Made into paper. Mm -hmm. Banana peels. Wow, those are appealing. <laughs> Isn't that amazing? Hey, uh, what do you got? Well, I got this little photo album. It has a picture of an elephant on it. It's kind of a rough texture. It says, photo album. <laughs> <laughs> hey, do y'all know what that's made out of? What's that? Elephant poo. Oh! I know that seems crazy and a little bit gross, but elephant poo is actually a natural antioxidant. So when they flatten it out, it dries out, and it turns in, into paper. It's just a way to save the trees, because they are going to run out eventually. So all vocal trash is trying to say is, folks, think before, before you throw, throw it away. away.